Hello guys, welcome to the Savvy Professor and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to use VLOOKUP in Smartsheet. So I am here in my Smartsheet and I'm just going to show you what I mean by that. So this is me typing something. So these are the values that I have here in my Smartsheet. And as you can see, the moment I type here something, there is a value that is going to come up because we have used the VLOOKUP function. Now if we are going to look this one here, this is actually where everything is coming. So the values are here for the cars and the price. And if I'm going to type, say, for example, this one here, you will see that it appears. The same thing if I'm going to copy and then paste it in here, you will see that the value appears in here. And the same thing for everything that is in here. Now I'm going to show you how to do this one. Okay, so now we are back here in our Smartsheet. And as you can see, I do not have any formulas in here. And we are going to start everything from the start. So we're going to click here. So we're going to type here VLOOKUP and then we're going to look for the search value. So I'm going to press this one here and then comma. Now we're going to look for a lookup table. So I'm going to reference another sheet. So I'm just going to click this one here and then you're going to select the sheets here. So for example, in my case, I'm going to reference this one here and then you will be able to rename this however you like, but I'm just going to let it there. Now, another thing that is very important is the value. So you'll have to make sure that you have selected the column. So I'm going to select this one and this one. So there are only two columns here that I need. So I'm just going to select them one and just click insert reference. All right, so we have already added here prices of cars range one and then we're going to go ahead and do after that one we're going to put comma and two and then zero so for the column number we use two because that is what is going to happen here and then we're going to put zero for the match type you can just search here for the definition here match type is optional the default is true so in my case we are using zero we're going to click enter and as you can see there is a little bit of a blue triangle here however there's nothing after that that is actually because we haven't typed anything in here yet so again we can manually type here say for example there you go or you can just copy this one here all right yeah something like that so another one is this one for example okay and yes congratulations everybody that is how you're going to use a vlookup in smartsheet